counting and representing data. Mummy, what are you doing? Bubbly, I am checking that which vegetables are left and how many are left. Mummy, I will also help you. Okay, Bubbly, come on. First of all, we group the vegetables and then we count them and then we write their numbers. Okay, Mummy. Friends, I am your friend Bola. We saw that Bubbly is helping her mummy in the kitchen. So come on, today we will see how Bubbly learns counting and representing data while helping her mother. Mummy, can I help you in grouping the vegetables? Yes, Bubbly. See, number of cabbages is 1 over here. So, we write 1 in front of cabbage. In the same way, we have to count the remaining vegetables and write the number against it. Yes, Mummy, I understood. There is 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 green chilies. So, we write 5 against green chilli. Carrots are 1, 2, 3 and 4 over here. So, we write 4 against carrot. Tomatoes are 1, 2 and 3 over here. So, we write 3 against tomato. Ok, Bubbly. Now, tell me which vegetable is most in number? There are five chilies, so it is most. You are right, Bubbly. Now tell me, which vegetable is least in number with us? There is one cabbage, so it is least in number. Well done, Bubbly. Thank you. Come on, now go and play. We can see that Bubbly is filling colours in the picture with different shapes. While colouring, she is thinking that can she count those different shapes and write their numbers separately. Just as she counted the vegetables and had written their numbers separately. Hey Bubbly, what are you doing? Look, Mummy, I am colouring this picture. Oh, wow! This picture is looking very beautiful. Bubbly, can you tell me which shapes are present in this picture? Mm, this shape is a circle and this one. This is a rectangle. This is triangle and this is a square. Come on, now tell me the names of these shapes. This shape is a circle. This is rectangle. This one is triangle. And this shape is square. Well done. Now tell me how many triangles are there in this picture. There are one, two, Three, four, five, and six. There are six triangles. Well done. Now tell me how many squares are there? One, two, three. Oh, oh, oh no, Bubbly. There is only one square here. Mummy, this is also a square, right? No, Bubbly. This is a rectangle. This shape is same as your pencil box. Okay, this is a rectangle. Yes, and the shape of the square is the same as your carom board. Okay, so there is only one square in this picture. Very good. Now tell me, 
How many rectangles are there? Rectangles are one, two, only two. Absolutely perfect. Look, mummy, there is one, two, and three circles in this picture. Well done. Now tell me all the shapes that you had counted. I counted triangles, squares, rectangles, and circles. Now tell me, which shape is most in number? There are six triangles over here. So this means triangles are most. There is only one square. So square shape is least in number. Perfect, Bubbly. Children, today we saw how Bubbly counted the shapes and found the number of each shape. She also learned which shape is most in number. and which is least in number in the next video we will see some interesting examples of counting objects and representing them in numbers